Hey everyone, Ragamune here, welcoming you back to more Let's Play Yu-Gi-Oh! Forbidden Memories. Last time, we took on that bastard Seto, and we kicked his ass. All hail the fusions! Today, though, it is time we head back to the Pharaoh's Palace, as we are entirely done here. Well, it's about time! Come on now, off to your room. I really hope you're ready to call it a day. I'm probably gonna fuck up the voices because I've been doing all this as, uh... I'm not pacing myself on this one, but... I love this game so much I gotta show off as much as I can while I can. Sometimes I wonder if the prince does this just to annoy me. Lord Simon, we have trouble. The, the High Mage. The High Mage Haishin and his men. They're wielding a strange power and invading the palace! What? I think it's sorcery, my lord. I'm afraid there's naught we can do to fend them off. Where's the High Mage now? In the palace hall, my lord. Hey, Sheen, hey, Sheen! Look at that dog have in mind! What? What the? It is good to see you again, Simon Murray. You dare to revolt! Are you mad? Mad? Me? I don't think so, but I've come to claim my throne. Your throne? Yes, my throne. For now, I have the power! Of He-Man? <laughs> the power? No! It cannot be! See, even he thinks it's He-Man. I see recognition in your eyes. Eh, but then, we both draw our roots from our sorcerer's forefathers. The power of darkness? That is correct. I've discovered the forbidden treasure. Here! Taste the pa taste the forbidden power of darkness! I don't know who this is. Thank god we have a yeah. But I'd like to think that this is the princess. Or or some kind of handmaiden. Prince, the high mage Heishin has invaded the palace. This place is too dangerous. We must leave at once. No! Prince, did you hope to escape me? We meet again. Alright, men, away with this servant. Yep, servant girl. I wish to speak with the prince. By your command! Prince! Be quiet and come with us. Why do you flee? Heishin already holds the king and queen captive. Running away would only provoke Heishin to end their lives. Is that what you want? Well, I'll tell you what I want. Something that one of only royal blood would know. The location of the Millennium Item. Tell me where it is and I'll spare the king and queen. You know where it is, so tell me. Hmm. Huh. I think you're bluffing. Don't take me for a fool, you know where it is. My prince! Simon Murrin! Dear prince, here's a millennium item. Take it. Take it and run. We get the millennium puzzle. Yay! Oh my god, he looks beaten up. You must keep this treasure from falling into the hands of these vermin. The treasure is the final key to unlocking the seal to great power. Should it fall into the hands of the wicked, it would be an Armageddon. Well, well, you couldn't have brought it at a better time. Hand the key over to me. To, hand the key over to me right now, and I might help you too. And I might help the two of you escape from Heishin. Ignore this car. He wags his tail at Heishin's command. He is not to be trusted. Leave him to me. You must escape. Out of my way, old man. Go, run. Listen to what I say. Get out of here. One of those but thou musts. Do not move. You are mine. I see you found them, Seto. Well done. Yes, my lord. You didn't think you could escape me, did you? There's no point in resisting. Admit your defeat. And hand it over. Give me the Millennium Item. Only one option remains, my prince. You must do battle with Heishin. Challenge him to a duel with your cards and the Millennium Item. But I don't know if I can beat him. 
My dear prince, you must confront him! The Millennium Item will unleash the dark powers of your cards! Face him! You must defeat Heishin! A wasted effort, boy! You lack the power to defeat me! Wanna know the sad part? That thing about us lacking the power... <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, here's your wake-up call to how brutally difficult this game will get. I'd have laughed if I started with a twin-headed right now. I'm gonna try to win, but I don't think I can. This guy will kill you. Look at that. Zero the man. 3,300 attack. I'm gonna play this. Oh shit, magic card. Yep, that's a widespread. Ow. Flame Cerberus. Cosmo Queen, look at that. By the way, all the cards that Heishin's using, well, almost all of them, are unobtainable. Now, considering this duel, you have... Here's the thing, though. Even if you beat him, he'll just come back and fight you again immediately. So it's best to just lose to him. This is the only duel that you can play, that you can lose, and not get a game over. In fact, you have to lose this duel. Look at that attack factor: 1782 compared to our measly 565. Oh God! Foolish child, you've wasted my time. If you insist on keeping the Millennium Puzzle, I'll just rip it from your lifeless fingers. <sighs> Out of my way, old man, or else... How many times are they going to use that line? My prince, shatter the Millennium Puzzle. You must not hand it over to this vile creature. Out of my way, old man. Get your hands off of me. If I had any, if I had any sense of editing, I would add a fucking count. Prince, the puzzle. Sh don't give them the puzzle. I don't want to shatter it. I beg you, the puzzle, shatter it. No! And welcome to the inside of the Fair's mind. Thank goodness you've awoken. We're inside the Millennium Puzzle. To be precise, your soul is now sealed within the puzzle. I'm sorry, my prince, but this is the only way I could save you in the puzzle. I couldn't allow you to simply hand over the puzzle to the likes of Heishin. The power of darkness that Heishin sought to unravel could only lead to the destruction. One day, when someone puts the puzzle together again, you will live to walk among men. Until that day comes, sleek, my prince. I'm sure there's someone out there destined to assemble the puzzle. In the end, that person will ga- Person- Blah. I'm terrible at this. In the end, that person and the Millennium Puzzle will guide you back to your world. Now rest. Close your eyes. Hey, Yugi! Wake up, Yugi! Huh? You dozed off, fella. Really? Oh, sorry. What's the matter? So nervous you couldn't sleep last night? I had a dream. You were dreaming? Man, nothing phases you, does it? Come on, it's time for the opening ceremony. Let's go! Welcome to the Yu-Gi-Oh! World Tournament, sponsored by the Kaiba Corporation. We're now at the town of Domino, where selected duelists have gathered to decide who is number one. This is it, Yu-Gi! Yeah. The battles are about to begin, and my hair is on edge to give you all of the announcing you need. But before we start, there are a few rules to explain. Tournament rules are divided. Between the preliminaries and finals, for example. Who cares? All about this. all you gotta do is keep winning. Right, Yugi? 
Huh? Uh, yeah, I guess so. And now a few words from our sponsor, Mr. Kaiba. Look at that freaking jacket he's wearing. I thank you for joining us in deciding I'm the king of kings. Today we duel to decide who is the ultimate game master, the ultimate duelist. And I too am intent upon winning that honor. Hey look, they're using Jonah's picture here. And Kaiba gets on my nerves. If anybody puts him out of the tournament, I hope it's me. You, I'm hoping to face you in the finals, you're alright? Sure. Alright then, ladies and gentlemen, may the best duelist win, and let the duels begin! Hi, Yugi. I'm working part-time at this card shop during the tournament. What do you want to do? Well, we're probably going to save, but that's pretty much going to end off today's episode. Because I'm pretty much reading out the dialogue word for word. I could skip over it, but where's the fun in that? Until then, this is Ragnamuna signing out. You guys have a great night. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye!